Okay, this is what I've done so far for making small briquettes for me to use for uh, possibly outdoor cooking fuel, okay? Now, I was gonna use a G-clamp to crush the, pa uh, the papier mache. This, um, this is made out of correspondence from the cable company, bank statements I didn't need, and old envelopes from a uh, combination of junk mail and more important things. This is the mold I used, and in the end I put the mash in there, put a jar on top and just used my weight to crush it. Initially I turned it sideways and just crushed it with my hands to get as much fluid pouring out as I could. Then I put all my weight on top, you know, leaning forward so just really squeeze out plenty. And every time the water welled up the side of the container, poured that out, okay? Uh, and then just carried on doing the same. Once it was done, I then took the paper cake out and then turned it over, did the process again, got a lot more water out because I guess it's reacting to the curvature of the bottom of the pot differently. And then now I set them to dry. The, these are very small. These are tiny, okay? These will have very short burn times when you do set them on fire because they're so small. And regular paper logs um, have a very short burn time anyway, apparently. So I hear thanks to the wonders of YouTube research. But at least it's something and I'm making a use from the fuel which is now available, all right? I was hoping I could possibly slice these into something similar to or would something that would have the effect of uh, pellets or twigs when used in the kelly kettle as well as the wood gas stove. That's what I was uh, I'm hoping so we'll just have to see. It'll take many 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 days for them to dry in the warmth of my flat and then we'll just see whether we can actually turn this into or you know just take them outside and see whether we can do a usable burning for you know hot water and so on and so forth. So I don't have massive hopes that they're going to give off um, you know a real like you know four hour cooking time it's more a question of like a short flash in the pan for 20 minutes out of thought rather than anything else but on the other hand it's still being useful and in this form it'll be more useful to me and probably less smoke through combustion than uh, in its raw paper format so that's what I've done today hope you found that interesting and or potentially useful haven't yet tried them We'll have to wait for a couple of days to give it a go.